Here are five biblical reasons for being part of Jesus' mission to take the good news to all the world. Jesus' Great Commission Go therefore and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all that I have commanded you. Matthew 28, 19-20 Jesus directly commanded his followers to spread the message of salvation. The harvest is plentiful. The harvest is plentiful, but the laborers are few. Therefore, pray earnestly to the Lord of the harvest to send out laborers into his harvest. Luke 10, 2 Many are ready to receive the message, but more workers are needed to bring them to Christ. All nations will hear the gospel. And this gospel of the kingdom will be proclaimed throughout the whole world as a testimony to all nations, and then the end will come. Matthew 24, 14. The mission to spread the good news is a prophetic requirement that precedes Christ's return. We are Christ's ambassadors. We are therefore Christ's ambassadors, as though God were making his appeal through us. We implore you on Christ's behalf, be reconciled to God. 2 Corinthians 5.20 Christians are called to represent Christ and his message to the world. These verses provide a strong biblical foundation for actively engaging in spreading the good news of Jesus to the world.